To insert an image into a Word document, click on the Insert tab. In the Illustrations group, you've got two main options. Picture is to insert an image from your hard drive, and Clip Art is as its name suggests. This replaces the old Insert Image from File, which is the picture, or Insert Image from Clip Art. Click on Clip Art first. Type in your search, and then press Go. Click on the image that you want to insert, and there it is in your Word document. Now by default, the text wrapping around this image is not particularly useful to us. It's in line with the text. As we can see here, the first paragraph is inserted partway down the page now rather than, in, rather than at the top. To create more useful text wrapping options around our image so that it integrates much more nicely into our Word document, click on the image first of all. Then in the new Picture Tools Format tab, click on the text wrapping option and choose either square or tight. For the moment I'll choose square. We can see now the text is wrapped around the image. Because it's square, the edge of the text in relationship to the edge of the image is a straight line. If I change the text wrapping to tight, we can see the more visual effect that is created as the text wraps around the shape of the image itself rather than a straight line. If the text wrapping of an image is set to either square or tight, you've also got the option of being able to click and drag to position your image anywhere you would like in your document. Square text wrapping is quite useful if you're trying to produce a more formal looking document. Text wrapping, however, is quite useful if you're trying to present a document that has some sort of visual flair to it as well. A poem with the text surrounding a central image as it cascades down the page, or something to that effect. 